Hi everyone. I haven't made a video for ages. I've been busy doing exams, which are crap, coursework, which is crap, and I went away for a bit, which wasn't crap, that was awesome. Um, so yeah, I haven't really been able to do any videos. I was going to make some videos, and I thought, no, but it would be a bit freaky if I was like in someone else's house and started randomly talking. They would have been like, Claire, what are you doing? Mind you, people say that to me a lot because I tend to do stupid things all the time. Like, yeah, really stupid things. But anyway, the point, I say anyway a lot as well. I really shouldn't do that. So I suppose I should sort of get to what I was going to talk about, which was people that know me should sit down. Mind you, you wouldn't really watch the video standing up. Anyway, because I tidied my room. I never tidied my room. Look, I shall show you. My floor is actually really tidy, except for my bag that's falling off my door. It's just a few bags there and that, but we forget about that. And my bed is actually made my phone on so as you can see my camera case is there but I actually tidied my room I won't show you the rest because that hasn't been done yet but I did actually tidy it and I'm so pleased with myself I think I should get like some sort of medal like the visual tidying of the room medal see when my friends come around because they all know my room is usually a tip and if I've tidied it up because sometimes I get made to which is horrible they're like, oh my god, Clay, our room's so tidy. I was like, yeah, I know. I don't do that. I'm such a sad room. But hey, I don't care. I also wanted to talk about another thing that happened to me today. Because obviously everyone knows how much I hate spiders. And I got out of the car. And there was this weird mole foil looking at me. It was like a spider. Well, obviously it was a spider. It had like a yellow back. It was really strange. And I was like, Mom, I the other spider, and it's really weird. So I ran away from it quickly before it could eat me, because it was looking at me. It was going to jump on me and eat me. It was going to, it was going to, I had a dream once about spiders. I was lying in bed, and these spiders just come and took chunks of my legs and that, which I wasn't complaining about, because I mean, it made me lose a bit of weight, but taking chunks of my legs, and I was like, whoa. It was a scary dream. That's some really scary dreams. Not so scary, freaky. I think I'm gonna have to make a video now about my freaky dreams. In fact, I might as well just put it in this video because this is gonna be a short video anyway. Okay, so some of the dreams I have are really strange. Like, I had a dream once when I was in Essex, that's where I come from, best place in the world, when I was lying in bed, and I used to have a bunk bed, like a really tall bed, like a cabin bed I think it's called, and like I got up in the night and there was a sheet dancing, going and that's what it was doing, and I was like, oh my god, I, it really scared me in the dream. What's my mum? Yeah, it was really strange. And then I had another dream once. But I was running from someone, God knows who, because I have these random people in my dreams. And I was like running down this alleyway and I slipped on a banana skin and fell on the floor. Then the banana skin flew up into my face. That was a really strange dream. I have some strange dreams. I've had others and now I can't remember them. What a div. I'm always telling my dream, my friends my dreams. And they're like, whoa, freaky deaky. I remember another one now. I was running. Someone was running from this big chicken. I don't know who it was. I think it was a guy, but I don't know who it was. It was this really tall big chicken, like a big mofo. And it was running. It was like a cooked, like, you know you get cooked chicken? But it wasn't cooked chicken, it was a raw chicken with no feathers and that on it. It was like running after this 
big guy, not big guy, this normal sized guy, chicken was big. And um, he fell over and the chicken fell on top of him. And I went over to the chicken, kicked the chicken and said, that's not very nice, how would you like if I stuck you in a big oven and cooked you all up and ate you? And somehow I managed to lift this chicken up, put it in this big mole fold and oven, and then that was it. But I think I felt sure if I ate it or not. But, strange. Really strange. Really, really strange. I also had another dream once, which was really, really weird. Well, I'd watched a film the night before called Dead Silence. It's like this horror film about these puppets and they're like this woman talks to them and that you have to watch it to get it because I watched it ages ago and um I had a dream that I had sex with a puppet that was strange it's really weird and the puppet was like alive and I'm talking to me <laughs> I'm normal so yeah, yeah. I now have food. Look. It's a fan that my mum made with strawberry. I think I should try some and then tell you what it's like. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's you will fall off stupid strawberries. It's actually really nice. I want some good flesh. Mmm. Really nice. You should get your mum to make a plan or make for yourself. I think I'm going to stop eating it now. The last thing I wanted to talk about and show you was my dad went away for 10 days to Austria. I really missed him when he went away. But anyway, he went away just for 10 days and he got me this really cool thing that it's a little trinket box it says Edelweiss Austria that's a flower and he got me this he said he found it on somewhere it's like a little pine cone I like things like that Ooh, my bed keeps making funny noises anyway I'm going to go now and hopefully there'll be more videos soon. I know I've got to do one, at least one, but hopefully there'll be more videos soon of me and my weirdness. I'll probably show you when the rest of my room's tidy as well. But there'll be more videos soon of me doing strange things. So, I said bye about 10 minutes ago, so I'm going to go now and leave you to do whatever you want to do. Tell me what you think of my video. This is the longest, this is the longest goodbye I think I've ever done. Aren't you happy? Anyway, goodbye.